Welcome to the Heikel Chemistry and Advanced Materials Science Building. The HCAMS building features over 56,000 square feet of research and instructional lab space for the Department of Chemistry and Biochemistry and the Advanced Materials Science Program. The building was constructed starting on July of 2017 was the groundbreaking and completed this last winter in January of 2019. So the main entrance of the building greets visitors with the Advanced Materials Center main office and further down the hallway we have the office for the Department of Chemistry and Biochemistry. Also on the first floor of HCAMS, we're really excited about our Nathan and Elaine Ballou shared research instrumentation facility. We already have students doing research in here. They're learning one of the dozens of research grade instrumentation that we have in this facility that will support both material science and chemistry research. Uh, on the second floor of HCAMS, we have more research and instructional lab space. Uh, we also have these beautiful stained glass pieces by artist Paul Hausberg that were inspired by chemistry molecules and advanced materials. And on the second floor is where we have our skywalk spans that connects HCAMS to the rest of the UMD campus. The HCAMS building is not officially open for courses yet, but we already have students using these popular student study lounge areas. These lounge areas are extremely well lit, have a beautiful view of Lake Superior and campus, and students have already been using these areas for studying. One of the central architectural design themes of the new HCAMS building that we're particularly excited about is the theme of science on display. On one side of the hallway, we have the state-of-the-art research laboratories, and opposite, we have the undergraduate instructional lab spaces. Also, in the hallway, we have spaces for collaboration and informal classroom time. We have these marker-writable walls that students actually already have been using to work together in groups and study for exams. I think what is very exciting about this new building is the opportunity for both teaching and research for our students. We now have facilities that are able to accommodate the cutting edge research that we want to do, as well as giving us space for our students to be able to um, experience cutting edge technology, use new instrumentation, all of this kind of culminates into a better student experience. I'm a transfer student. The reason I picked UMD was because of the new building, because uh, I thought it would open up a lot more opportunities and a lot more opportunities to do lab work. Just the number of hoods and usable space that you have in this lab is so much nicer. You can have people working on multiple things in different areas without running into each other or dancing around each other and getting in the way. So yeah, it's been very nice working in this building. In, in the old building, it was uh, sometimes very challenging because we didn't have space and we didn't have the appropriate space to do the modern research that we wanted to do with, with hoods and storage. Also, the open uh, concept is uh, very important for the students to be able to collaborate. And so what this building is kind of um, primed to do is to be a place for material science-focused faculty to come together. Um, as part of this, we also have an in, uh, exciting and new interdisciplinary master's program, the Advanced Materials Science Master's Program, where students of, from engineering and science backgrounds will come together um, to learn both the science and the engineering side of material science. I spend all my time here, whether it's studying with other graduate students, um, they help me a lot, uh, or just doing my research, or spending time in the wings actually studying. is It's a great building.